Yep. She's my high school sweetheart. <laughs> We've built a really beautiful life here. Like I wouldn't be who I am without him. And I mean, I don't think you'd be who you are without me either. <laughs> Two beautiful kids now. They're my whole world. It's just everything to me. I am very grateful to be here today. Things could have been very different for me. It was August 20th, 2021. We were going on a road trip that day and um, my whole life changed. Come on, buddy. I had let our dog out in the morning to go to the bathroom. Then I called for him to come back in and he came back up the steps. And I was trying to be as quiet as possible so as not to wake anyone and that was the last thing I remember, was standing here in the hallway. I heard a, a bang. I just kind of happened to kind of get up and, and look over the bed and I saw her laying face down on the bedroom floor. And obviously that's when I knew something was, was very wrong. I did a quick assessment um, just to figure out what might be going on. Of course, we didn't have any warning. Um, there was no previous history. We called 911 as quickly as possible and Things could have been really different. For all of us that day, um, if I were alone, who could I have hurt on the road? I'm just grateful for a lot of it, the way it, the way it played out. We saw results we don't ever want to see on the halter monitor. You have um, a deadly arrhythmia. I wore it for 14 days and it picked up 12 instances or episodes of this tachycardia. The highest heart rate was over 300 beats per minute. And trying to wrap my head around the fact that it could happen again at any time was terrifying. If it were to happen again, if my arrhythmia was going to pop up again, this device would save me. I have the emblem, SICD. So it's nice, I don't have it embedded up here. You can't see it under my clothes. I don't have leads going directly to my heart. I have a security guard that's kind of watching out for me. I just need to give it a name. <laughs> Since I got my device, I think I've just been able to, I don't know, I, it's just like a, a, better, a better version of myself, of who I was before. Once I got my device, I started seeing Boston Scientific everywhere. It's been about a year and a half now that I've been in this job. I only wish I could have found it earlier. Tori is the absolute best. She is so kind, caring, and we're lucky to have her. It's really interesting Matt's job and profession and to think that he walked in and experienced his wife on the floor. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's okay. I'm okay. I'm here. I'm yeah. Okay. I'm kicking. To think that Tori was so young when it happened and didn't have any predisposition or knowledge that something like that was um, was a possibility for her. I think oftentimes when we're developing devices, we think about the patient that's being treated, but it's really the entire family that is affected. The stuff that we have gone through and the life that we've built and the relationship that we have um, has prepared us for whatever's thrown at us in the future as well. So very grateful. I love you too. Thank you for everything. Because of my implant, I can be the wife and the mom that I want to be.